Mom, have you seen my phone? No, and you're not allowed to have it. Why not? Because you're not allowed to have anything that has a reflection on it. You must guess your symbol without looking at yourself. Okay, well, give me a hint. No giving hints either. You and the other person would both die. Well, then how am I supposed to guess it? Just start guessing things. Star. Heart. Circle. Yeah, good luck guessing that one. Is mine hard? Not hard, but I've seen easier. What's the point of this anyways? You guess your symbol, you're safe. You cheat or don't guess in time, you die. In time? How much time do we have? Until sundown. <sighs> Rectangle. Dollar sign. Squiggly line. Squiggly line? Really? I'm desperate. There's only one hour left until sundown. Wait, did you guess yours already? Yeah. How? I have never seen that symbol before in my life. There's like 300 people in this school, right? Right. So the odds of you having someone's symbol? High. I just guessed what I saw on people's foreheads. That's genius. Umbrella. Rectangle. Square. Triangle. Jess, hurry up. It's sundown. Jess, hurry. 10 seconds until midnight. Diamond? I got it. Barely. Is it just me or did it get weirdly quiet in here? A lot of people didn't guess their symbol in time. They disappeared. Mom, I'm home. Mom? Mom? Who is it? Mom! Thank you, sweetie. I could not find my keys. I... I thought you didn't guess your symbol. I thought I... Don't be dramatic. I had to go get more milk. Ours was three months old. Gross. Well, the round's over. Can I have my phone back now? No way. Why not? Because there's still two more rounds left. Tomorrow, we do it again. All right. Hopefully, I can guess this quick today. Triangle. Diamond. With those guesses, you're going to be guessing all day. What do you mean? It's colors today, not symbols. Oh. Red. Orange. Yellow. Trying out my trick? Yeah, but it's not working. Tell me about it. Hey, are you okay? My brother didn't guess it in time yesterday. He disappeared. Oh my god, Danny. I'm so sorry. This whole thing's messed up. I don't get the point of it at all. Class, today we're going to be making biscuits from scratch. You have the entire class to do so. You can't use that. Why not? It has a reflection on it. It's not even supposed to be out. You didn't see your color on it, did you? No. Promise? Promise. Can I go to the bathroom? I'm totally screwed. I can't believe I just saw myself. Coral. Why didn't I disappear? You guessed it. Yeah, completely, 100%, totally without cheating, <laughs> obviously. Otherwise, I would have disappeared, you know, so. Are you okay? Yeah, this whole thing's just screwing with my head a little bit. Did you know Danny's little brother went missing? We just have to get through tomorrow. Then this will be all over with. If we can make it through tomorrow. Where is it? Here it is. Look in the mirror, Jess. You can do it. Mom, this whole thing is made up. What makes you say that? I just looked in the mirror and nothing happened. Don't joke about that. I'm serious. Here, look in the mirror. Get that away from me. Put that away, Jess. That's not funny. I'm telling you, it's fine. Just look in the mirror. <gasps> mom? I just killed my mom. Let's see what I got today. Revenge? I have a feeling not many people are going to guess their words. Jess, I'm freaking out. Do you know how many words there are in the universe? A lot. A freaking lot. And it can be any language. There's a chance I won't make it to tomorrow. After seeing everyone's words, I don't think anyone's going to make it till tomorrow. I haven't heard you guessing at all. Are you giving up? I may have already guessed mine. What? How? Luck. Class, please try to stay calm. There's 15 seconds until midnight. Just say as many words as you can. Three, two, one. Am I the only one left? Congratulations, you are a finalist. Please make your way to the stadium for the fourth and final round. Final round? I thought there were only three rounds. Jess? Danny? You guessed yours too? Yeah. I wonder how many others did. I don't know. Congratulations, finalists. As you can see, there were only five of you who were able to complete all three rounds. Now you five will compete for the chance to win $100,000. Why would we want the money when all our loved ones are dead? They're not dead. We were holding them in a separate realm until our finalists were revealed. Fill the stadium. See, your loved ones are here. Mom! Jess! 
yes, win this for us. This round will be different than any other. You will all receive a number one through 10 and you can tell each other what their numbers are, but you can also lie to each other. You will have one hour to talk. Then it will be time to make your guess. You only get one. What if we don't guess it? Then you die. Wait a second. We die or we just go to the other realm like our families did? No, you die. There has to be consequences for being a finalist. Okay, well, I don't wanna play. Can I just sit in the stadium with my mom? No, you're a finalist. You have to play unless you wanna forfeit and die. I shouldn't be a finalist though. Jess, what do you mean? I cheated. You did? Yes, I looked in the mirror. That's the only way I won the rounds. Everyone here cheated. Really? Yes, it's the only way to win the game. But to prevent you all from telling each other you can cheat, we made the rule if you try to tell someone, that person will disappear. That's why when I showed my mom... She disappeared, which made you think you're the only one that could cheat. But everyone here cheated. Now everyone, do you want to play or die now? Ben? Play. Tina? Play. Jonathan? Play. Danny? Play. And Jess, what did you decide? Play. You have one hour to talk to each other. At the end of the hour, you will all make your guess for what your number is. We won't allow any cheating this round. So don't even try looking at your reflection. Let the games begin. So who wants me to tell them what their number is? Jess? Yours is an eight. I didn't ask you, Tina, and frankly, I don't believe you. Good, you shouldn't. She's lying to you. Jess, what's my number? A seven. Ugh, everyone told me a different number. You can't trust anyone here. I don't even know who to believe. Danny, believe me. We both can win this if we're 100% honest with each other. Neither of us have to die. Yeah, you're right. Your number is a three. A three? Yes. Now promise me mine's a seven. Promise. I promise. Jess, you've been awfully quiet. Everything okay? I don't need you getting in my head, Tina. I already know what I'm going to guess. Well, hopefully it's right because your life depends on it. And so does yours. So how about instead of lying to people, you gain someone's trust and tell them the truth? I didn't lie to anyone here. I told Benny at a four, Danny a seven, and you an eight. You told Danny he had a seven? Yeah. But Danny said everyone told him a different number. Well, maybe everyone did. No, I told Danny he had a seven too. That's the problem. You can't trust anyone in here. Everyone, it is time to guess your numbers. Ben, you're up first. Six. That is incorrect. <sighs> Tina, you're next. Three. Jonathan, your turn. Uh, I guess five. That is incorrect. That leaves us with two contestants left. Danny, your turn. I guess seven. That is correct. Congratulations. Jess, guess three. And Jess, if you can guess this, you will split the $100,000 with Danny. Eight. That is correct. Congratulations. <sighs> I can't believe I did it. Me either. You lied to me. I didn't think they were going to allow two winners, okay? I was afraid if we both won, we both would die. Don't ever talk to me again. Jess. Mom. <sighs> Thank God this is all over with. Until next year. They said this would be a yearly thing now. Bella, are you going to play Mother May I? No way. It's too risky. You know it's for $10 million though, right? That's a ton of money. Yeah, and you know the losers die, right? It's a death sentence. That's why they only allow six participants. I'm gonna play. Jess, no! You're gonna die! No, I'm gonna be rich. Welcome to the game. You and the other five participants will be living in the arena while you play. Mother is so excited to meet you. Where is she? She's watching. Follow me. Hi, my brave participants. I am Mother, and welcome to Mother May I. The game is simple. Do as I say, and you'll move on. Don't, and you'll die. The last one alive wins $10 million. Good luck. Mother, may I sit down? You may not. Mother, may I take a nap? You may. Lucky. Hey, want some chips? Fine, more for me. Oops, looks like someone forgot to ask Mother. Oh, my bad. Mother, may you forgive me? Mother does not. <laughs> Five more to go. Mother, may I awaken from my nap? You may. Mother, may I eat something? Hmm. You may not. Mother, may I have some water? Hmm. You may not. Mother, may I have some water? You may. 
Mother, may I have some food? You may. Mother, please, can I have some water? You may not, but you may do the one chip challenge. What? That's like super spicy. Mother insists. <coughs> Mother, he's choking. May I help him? You may not. <laughs> Only four more to go. It kind of seems like Mother's targeting people. Mother, may I use the restroom? You may. Oh, thank goodness. Hey. Oh, you scared me. I didn't expect anyone to be in here. I wanted to talk to you. Is it just me or does Mother seem to be favoring player two? Mother's watching. Not in the bathroom, she's not. I think that's like illegal. Yes, she is. Just ask her something. It'll prove it. Fine. Mother, do I have to ask to flush? You do. Mother, may I flush? You may not. But since you think I'm being so unfair, you may drink it. Drink what? Oh my God, no. Are you saying no to mother? Yeah, I'm not doing that. I could get sick. Hmm, too bad. <laughs> Only three more to go. Mother, may I go to sleep? You may not. Mother, may I go to sleep? You may. Mother, may I go to sleep? You may not. It's not fair. You let player two do everything. Do you have something you'd like to say, player six? Yeah, I do. Mother, may I know, is this game rigged? Yes, you may. I'm listening. You may know after you die. No, please, I didn't disobey you. I'm just saying, it doesn't seem fair. Player four, do you think mother's fair? Yes, mother, I do. Good. Then you can do the honors of shooting player six. What? Mother, may I refuse? You may not. Please, please don't shoot me. I, I, I don't want to die. If I don't, then we both die. Hurry up, player four. Mother is waiting. I'm sorry. <laughs> Good job, player four. You made mother proud. What? <coughs> Mother, may I cry? You may not. Only two participants left. One of you will win $10 million. Mother, may I eat? You may. Mother, may I eat? You may not. Has mother said no to anything you've asked? No, I mean, at least not yet. It's not fair. Mother never said the game was fair, player four. Mother, May I stop playing Mother May I But Live? You may not. Then what are you waiting for? The winner is in your hands. Just put the loser out of their misery already. You're right, player four. I am. Mother will now choose who wins and kill the other. R right now? D don't you want to think about it first? Mother knows. Mother always knows. One of you is about to win $10 million. But first... Mother, you saved me? <laughs> Congratulations, player I four. I won! Jess, you won, Mother May I? I don't know how I did it. I can't believe you're alive. And I'm rich. I'm so proud of you. Hello there, player four. Mother? Mother felt like she didn't get a proper goodbye. Don't you owe Mother a thank you? I know how you can thank Mother. Mother would like to stay with you forever. Will you accept, Mother? Good morning, player four. Good morning, mother. Mother doesn't like waiting. When will you decide if she can stay with you forever? I'm still thinking, mother. Mother, why did you decide to save me instead of player two? She was clearly your favorite the entire game. Yes, mother loved player two, but mother realized player two would have never killed for mother like you did. You're loyal to mother, and mother wants to stay loyal to you. Did you do it yet? Ashley, shh. Wait, if I say no, something bad will happen. She can't control you anymore. The game's over. I know that, but I also can't control her. Well, she can go back to game land and wait for next year's contestants. You don't need her in your life. Mother is getting impatient. Well, I'm not deciding right now. Ashley's on her way over. About that. I wouldn't wait around for Ashley. Mother, 
What did you do? Ashley wasn't a good influence on you. Mother is helping you. I didn't ask for your help. Please pick up, please pick up, please pick up. Jess, is that you? This is Ashley's mother. Is Ashley okay? I'm afraid not. There's been an incident. They think she was poisoned. Is she? She's in the hospital, but they expect her to make a full recovery. <gasps> oh, thank goodness. I'll come see her as soon as I can. She would love that. I'll keep you posted. Mother, you can't be hurting my friends. Mother is sorry, player four. Do you forgive her? I can't trust you. I appreciate you letting me win. I really do, but you can't stay with me. Mother loves you, player four. Will you give mother another chance? No. Ashley! Jess! Thank goodness you're okay. Did you finally tell mother no? Yes, and I'm so sorry I didn't do it sooner. I can't believe she poisoned you. Me either. I'm just glad I'm okay. Me too. <laughs> Almost. Is a job for a grown. Hello, can I help you? Hi, I'm new to the neighborhood and brought you a gift to say hi. Are you okay? Yeah, sorry. Your voice just reminds me of someone. Oh. Thanks for the gift. You're welcome. What did you say your name was? My name's Amba. That's pretty. What does it mean? Mother. I have to go. That was weird. Hello? This is the creator of Mother May I. Is this player four? Yes. We seem to have a little issue. Mother is missing. What do you mean you can't find Mother? She's an AI. We've been experimenting with putting her intelligence into a human body. She seems to have stolen the body and left. Why are you telling me this? We want to make sure Mother doesn't find you. If she does, you could be in serious danger. I think she already has. Can't you guys shut her down? She recoded her reset button without us knowing. It will take weeks for us to figure out how to reset her. Well, then how do you plan on stopping her? Um. Hello? Yeah, we don't know. Jess, it's Amba, your neighbor. How did you get into my house? You left the window on the second story unlocked. You would have needed a ladder. Yeah, I have a ladder. You can't just break into people's houses. What are you doing here? To see you. Let's just talk about this over some coffee. I don't need you staring at me while I sleep. What are you doing? Nothing. This is not just waiting for the coffee to brew. You called the cops on me. Give no. me that. Mother was really hoping she didn't have to do this, but you don't seem to understand how much mother loves you. She just wants to take care of you. If you wanted to take care of me, then you'd let me go. No, because mother knows you'll try and hide from her. What happened to us, player four? In the game, you killed for mother. Now you won't even look at her. It was a game. I didn't kill for you. I killed for myself to hopefully make it out alive. What are you saying, player four? Do you not love mother? Mother? What are you doing? Mother chose the wrong player. Goodbye, player four. Mother, you love me, right? Mother does not understand her processor. She loves you, but she wants to kill you. That's because you're not human. You'll never be able to be my mother or understand me or my feelings because you don't have the human experience. The best thing you can do for me, mother, if you really love me, is to let me go. That's what humans do. When they love something, but they don't get that love back, they don't kill them. They let them go. This is new information to mother. Letting go. Letting go. Mother knows what she has to do. Goodbye, player four. Mother, what are you doing? I'm shutting myself down. I'm letting you go. You're right, player four. I will never be human. I will never be your mother. You will always be my AI mother. Powering down. Goodbye. Are you okay? I heard mother was holding you hostage. She was, she completely lost it. Where is she? Where's mother? You must be the game maker. Well? You know how you said mother was the only person that knew how to shut herself down? Yeah. Well, that's what she did. What do you mean? Where's her body? She's in there. Mother, I'm coming. Well, I think we're finally in the clear from mother now. I hope so. Mother, if you can hear me, don't worry. I'm gonna fix you up. I'm gonna get you back working in no time, okay? Marco. Polo. Marco. Polo. Marco. Polo. Polo. Daddy. Sweetie, we're.
we're home. What's wrong? <laughs> Daddy, he's gone. What do you mean he's gone? <laughs> Mommy, I said Polo as loud as I could, just like you told me to. It's gonna be okay. <laughs> Marco! Polo! <laughs> not funny, Jonathan. Oh, shoot. Wait, weren't you the girl that lost her dad as a kid? She's not the only one that lost a family member, Jonathan. Hey, sorry. You okay? Yeah. I'll see you tomorrow. Mom, why are there so many cop cars at the Nelsons? Their daughter, Anna. She wasn't found today. No. Yeah. I'm making them some food if you want to help. Yeah, of course. Can you go ask your sister if she wants to help too? Hey, loser. Mm -hmm. Ellie? Marco! Polo! Marco! Polo! Marco! Where are you? Polo! Marco! Polo! Safe. Jess. Are you okay? Yeah, it was really scary. I know, I know. It's okay. You're safe now. You okay? You haven't touched your drink. Yeah, I'm fine. Order from Marco? Polo! Jess, relax. It's just his name. Right. Sorry. It's just... My sister was picked earlier, and after losing my dad to the game a couple years ago, I- I get it. But luckily, once someone's chosen, they're not chosen for a couple years. Your sister's gonna be okay. Yeah. It is your turn to play. Oh no. Starting in three, two, one. Marco? 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 Polo? Ellie? Found. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm fine. You were yesterday, I was today. We should stay near mom, she could be next. Mom, you can't go into work today. Sweetie, I have meetings with very important clients today. I can't miss that. They can wait. You could get picked today. I could get picked any day. And even if I was home, it doesn't mean I'd be found. But you have better chances if Ellie and I are near you. I'm going to work. End of discussion, I'll see you tonight. You good, Jess? Jess. Jess! How are you not just living in a constant fear that someone you loved is going to get picked and not found? Uh, I think that's called anxiety. Yeah, well, it sucks. I'll feel better about it once my mom makes it through her round. Then we all shouldn't be picked for a couple years. Ellie, is mom home yet? No, but she said not to worry, remember? <laughs> I'm not worried. Do I look worried? Yeah, you do. Hello? Is this Jessica Archer? This is she. You might want to sit down for this. We found your mom's car, but she wasn't in it. We believe she was taken by the game. I'm sorry. Are you sure? She could have wandered down the street. It's so dark when you're playing. People wander miles. We've checked everywhere, and it was confirmed that she was chosen today. I'm so sorry. <gasps> I hate this stupid game! Jess, is everything okay? It took mom. No. We need to start planning the funeral. No need. What do you mean, no need? Because I'm going to try and bring them back. You can't bring them back. They're dead. How do you know? We never see their bodies. That doesn't mean they're not gone. How would you even bring them back? I'm going to make the game take me. Are you nuts? No, I'm going to forfeit so I can see where they go. They die, You Jess. have been selected. It's my turn. That's impossible. You shouldn't have been selected again so soon. I don't know, but I'm going to bring everybody back. Jess, you can't bring them back. They're gone. Please, don't forfeit the game. I can't lose you, too. You're not going to lose me. Game starting now. Say Marco to be found. It appears you don't understand. Say Marco. Polo! Jess! Are you out there? Try saying Marco. Or say help for the rules to be repeated. Polo! Come on, Jess! Polo! Five, four, three, two, one. Failed. Where am I? Hey. Oh, Mom? Jess! Perfect timing. We're almost up for Pepsi Pong. Pepsi Pong? What is this place? Polo Planet. The place you get to party if you lose Marco Polo. I'm so happy you joined us. I'm not staying. I'm here to bring you back. Bring me back? Why would I want to go back? I love it here. They're holding you hostage here. <laughs> no, they're not. The exit's right there. We can leave at any time. All this time you had the option to go and you chose to stay? Look around. It's a party. Mom, Ellie and I are down there by ourselves. Is Dad here too? You girls are so independent. Yeah, he's in the cot taking a nap. Ooh, it's almost our turn. Come on. No, I can't leave Ellie. Suit yourself. It was nice seeing ya. 
You really won't come back with me? Don't you miss being a family? Of course I do. But look, there's something you gotta know. I'm the happiest I've ever been here. You should stay. I can't do that to Ellie. I'm sorry. Tell that hi for me. Hey, next time you come, bring Ellie. Leaving so soon? Yeah, I want to leave this polo planet. Send me back to Earth. Oops, it looks like we're not able to do that for you yet. What? Why not? You have to be on Polo Planet for at least 24 hours before you can go. Seriously? But hey, you can wait over there with all the others. Pepsi, while you wait? I'm good. You waiting to leave too? Yeah. How many hours have you been waiting? 12. You're halfway there. You want some of my Pepsi? I'm okay. Why are there so many people getting out of line? You'd be surprised how many people I've seen wait all day just to get out of line. That's weird. Right? Like, why change your mind an hour before leaving? Hey, it's almost your time to go back. Yeah, but I've been thinking, I really want to stay. Why would you do that? You seemed excited to go back. Why would you stay? I didn't give this place a chance. I love it here. Pepsi, while you wait? No, I'm good. I think there might be something in the Pepsi. Water, get your waters. Anybody want a water? I do, over here. What do you think you're doing? Handing out waters. What, they can't drink anything but Pepsi on this planet? Weren't you leaving? I still got two more hours. I think we can make an exception. You can go early. I appreciate the offer, but I think I'm gonna stay for the next two hours. Mom, Dad, did you drink your waters? Yeah, my head feels fuzzy. Fuzzy? Yeah, what did you put in this? I didn't put anything in it. I'm all confused. I feel sad, like I want to leave Polo Planet. That's good. You guys can come back with me. Are you tricking us? Yeah, you're making us feel like we want to leave. She's brainwashing us. Get her! No, I'm not trying to trick you. Just come back with me. If you don't like it, you can always come back here. She has a point, Elma. I do have this feeling that I miss home. I have that same feeling. We'll come with you. It's been 24 hours. The three of us would like to leave. Bummer. Anyone want a Pepsi for the road? Yeah, I do. No, we don't want the Pepsi. Fine, those doors will take you back to Earth. We're back. Jess? Ellie! Mom, Dad, I missed you. Now we can all be a family again. Thank you for bringing us back, Jess. I forgot how good it feels here. Jess, Mom and I are going to the mall. Wanna come? No, I'm gonna stay here and hang with Dad. That's my girl. Hey, Dad, remember this guy? How could I forget him? <gasps> What's wrong? I've been selected. Marco! Polo! Do you want to play Kiss Mary Kill? No way. For the chance to win one million dollars. On second thought, count me in. Operation Kiss Someone is on. Who are you going to kiss? No idea. I shouldn't have entered this competition. There's no way I'm going to complete it the fastest. Regina already kissed someone. You could kill Regina. And do what? Push her in front of a bus? Yeah, that would work. You know, it's not a terrible idea. Sup, bro? Ooh, hot jerk alert. I'm going in. Hey, Chase. Wanna chase me with those lips? Do I wanna what? Wanna kiss me? Jess, you're playing? Yeah, I am. This is like charity work if I kiss you then, right? Yeah, you can totally put this on your college application. Okay then, come here. Ow, what was that for? That was for being a jerk. All right, one down, two to go. Look out, duck. She tried to kill me. It's part of the game, it's not that deep. Girls, the games are very dangerous. Neither of you should be playing them. Now back to class, both of you. Hey Jess, wanna get married? Yeah. Great, tonight? Wait, you already have kiss and kill? Yep, just need marry. Sorry, I can't marry you. What, why? If I marry you, you win the game. I'm trying to win the game. That's a little selfish. Good luck. Now who to convince to marry me? Ryan! What, Jess? You know all those times you cheated off me in English and I never told? Uh, no, I have no idea what you're talking about. Uh-huh. Well, I'm cashing in my favor. You have to marry me. Wait, are you blackmailing me? No, I'm just encouraging you to help me like I did you. Fine, I'll meet you at the courthouse after school. All right, see you there, hubby. Don't call me that. You may now kiss the bride. Or we could high five. Yeah, high five. Hey, thanks for helping me. I'll see you next week for a divorce. You got it. I hope you win, Jess. Girl, you're in the top 10% of the game ranking. I know, I'm so close to winning this thing. 
But the thought of killing someone literally makes you want to vomit. But the thought of one million dollars? Does make it sound a little better. Who are you going to kill? And when? Are you gonna do it soon? Yeah, but it's time for me to go. I'll tell you later. Is it just me or is that car coming at me suspiciously fast? I think they're trying to rear end me. It must be their target. I think I lost him. Ooh. That was an, uh... I killed them? Congratulations, you have won one million dollars. Yay? Thanks again for letting me borrow your toothbrush. Anytime. Did, Did you, you do, do the, the homework? homework? Jinx, knock on wood. Shoot. I can't believe we just jinxed. Hurry, Billy Jean. You have to knock on wood before the time runs out. Yeah, I know. I just don't see anything made of wood. Hang on. I might have a pencil. Just hurry. The timer's running out. I don't have one. No, but that means... <laughs> Sebastian. Here. Jess. Here. Billy Jean. She's, She's no, no longer, longer with, with us. us. Jinx, Jinx, knock, knock on, on wood. wood. Huh, I was first. You have to knock on wood. No, I said it before you. No, I said it before you. You're jinxed. I am not. And if I knock on wood and I'm not jinxed, I'll die. I guess we're about to find out which one of you is actually jinxed. <sighs> I knew I wasn't jinxed. Can we get the body pickup patrol? Hey, Mom. Hey, sis. How was your day, sweetie? Not good. Billy and I jinxed today, and she didn't knock on wood in time. I, I always, always liked, liked her. her. Jinx, knock on wood. Oops, you got me, sweetie. Mom, knock on wood. Yeah, Mom, don't forget. Mommy, hurry. The time's running out. I'm fine. That's not funny. I can't believe I overslept. I'm going to be so late for school. Excuse, Excuse me. me. Jinx, knock on wood. Shoot, I do not have time for this. There. What? Why didn't it work? Because the floor's made of laminate. You have to knock on real wood. Out of my way! <sighs> there. Jessica, please tell me you have a good reason for disrupting the class. I do. If I didn't interrupt, I would have died. Okay, well, just go sit down, please. Did I miss anything important? School-wise, not at all. Gossip-wise? Hmm, Sebastian jinxed Emma and she didn't make it. No shot. Oh, it gets worse. Then Jason started bawling his eyes out. Apparently, Emma and Jason were having a secret affair. Emma was a little devil. Girls, quiet down. Does anyone know the answer to number 67? 4927. Jinx, knock That is correct. Why is there a countdown? Jess, Anna jinxed you. No, she didn't. Yes, I did. I'm pretty sure she did. I didn't hear you. I said it, I swear. Jess, come on, knock on wood. Is this some kind of sick joke? Because you both know if I knock on wood when I'm not jinxed, I die. I would not joke about this. Jess, we're being for real, come on. <sighs> You're safe. You weren't lying. I told you, I would never lie. I've only lied about killing my neighbor. Please don't tell anyone. Okay, Anna, that's really freaking sus. Hey, sis. Hey, how, how was, was your day? Name? Jinx. Darn it. Sis, get out of the car right now. Go knock on wood. Run, sissy, run! I'm running. Don't worry, I found some Wait, wood. sis, that's not... <gasps> Next. Excuse me, do you guys sell blocks of wood? Someone trying to beat the system? No, but I lost someone really special to me today because there wasn't any wood nearby. I can't have that happen again. I'm sorry to hear that, sweetie pie, but we've been sold out of wood for years. Thanks anyway. Miss, you didn't hear this from me, but you might be able to find a wood keychain at this address. What is this? The address to the woman who sells keychains out of her basement. You might be able to get one. You have to stop giving these to people. Who gave you these? I got these cards from the woman herself. I don't understand why you're freaking out, ma'am. What's the problem? Where have you been, young lady? Mom, I need to tell you something, and you're not going to like it. I already know your sister died in the Jinx game. The body patrol called me. I wish it was just that. But it's not. Then what is it? It's okay, sweetie. You can tell me. Dad's out of jail. What? How do you know? Did he come to your school? Did he hurt you? No, no. But I was at the store today, and she gave me one of these. So he's out of jail, and he's already making false wood keychains? This is the same address he did it at before. Yeah, that's how I put it together. What an idiot! He's going to get caught again, and this time, they might not let him out of jail. So you really didn't know he was out either? Of course not, sweetie. We have to turn him in. We can't let innocent people walk around thinking that their problems are solved with a wood keychain just to find out it's not made of wood. 
Mom, there's one more thing. What is it, sweetie? The store clerk said a female gave her these cards. This time, I don't think Dad's working alone. You're sure she said female? I'm positive. I was surprised too. Well then, we know what we have to do. Are you sure you want to call the police? Yes. I didn't call them soon enough last time and lots of people died. Are you expecting anyone? No. I'll, I'll get, get it. it. Jinx! Dang it! Mom, why did you do that? I'm sorry, sweetie, but I can't let you knock on wood. What? Get out of my way! No! He Mom, stop! stop. Jess, stop! Stop! Uh. Oh no. There. You really shouldn't have done that, sweetie. What do you mean? Why would you try and hurt me? Oh, sweetie, your dad's not out of jail. He's still in there. And he's gonna be in there for a long, long time. Mom, what did you do? It was all me. The plotting, the scheming, the fake wood keychains. <laughs> I'm a genius that tricked thousands of stupid souls into buying those things. And framed your father for all of it. And responsible for them all dying. I knew you wouldn't be proud of me. You never appreciated what I went through to put a roof over our heads. Sure, them dying wasn't an ideal situation, but do you know how much people were paying me for those false hope keychains? More than Taylor Swift tickets. If that's not dad, then who's at the door? Hopefully the mailman. I need more keychains. Hello? Hi. Anna? Now's really not a good time. I came to see you about something. Look, if this is about you killing your neighbor, I'm not going to tell anyone. I have enough to worry about. It isn't about that. If I was truly worried, I would have hit you with my car. Excuse me? And then dragged your body into a dark, dark, dark cave. Okay, I never want to get on your bad side. No, you really don't. Anna, look, you really need to go. My mom bought a fake wood keychain from your mom. Oh, I am so sorry, Anna. Did she, you know, did she? No, she did not. Oh, thank goodness. She was close enough to real wood to still knock in time. It was a total bummer. Okay, so again, why are you here? Because I wanted to know if you were aware that your mom is doing this. Yes, but only until recently. I'm gonna handle it. Respectfully, I think it's time people stepped in. Get her, boys. Huh? FBI, hands up. What in the Hannah Montana? Anna, are you working for the FBI? Yes, in my free time. Well, you know, Anna over here isn't all that innocent either. Just five minutes ago, she threatened to hit me with her car. Anna speaks too quietly. We can't pick it up on the mic, but I can guarantee she didn't say that. Well, she did. I'm innocent until proven guilty. Is your mom in there? All right, let's move in. One at a time. Oh. Mom, don't say anything, okay? We'll get you a really good lawyer. Tell me you love me, sweetie. Of course I do. Say it, please. I love, I love you. you. Jinx! Mom, knock on wood! Officer, make her knock on wood. I'm fine, sweetie. Please, just let me be. No. Mom, come on. It's gonna be okay. Mom! We're about to go over everything your mom left you behind. Are you sure you're ready to do this? Yeah. It's time. All righty then. The main thing she left you was her company. Her keychain company? No, no, she never did have a license for that. Of course. Here, I'll let you take a look yourself. She left you this company. Jinx Inc? What is that? Let's just say you call the shots now in the Jinx game. Me? Basically, you're in control. If you want to change the time limit, you can. How many Jinx someone has before they die, you can. Anything, really. Oh my goodness. If she helped create the game, my mother was a terrible person. Maybe, but she was also a creative genius. Shut it down. Now, miss, I know this is probably- Shut it down. Maybe we could discuss the pose. I don't need to discuss it. Fine. But before you do, there is one thing you should know. Do this. Spin in a circle. Billy Jean! What? Spin in a circle! She said do that. No, she said do this. Hurry! There. You have to listen, Millie Jean. You almost didn't make it. Do that. Clap three times. Billie Jean? Yeah? Was that you who just clapped? Yeah. No! Hey, I heard about your friend, Billie Jean. I'm really sorry. Thanks. She was a really good friend. She was dumb as a rock. It's a miracle she made it this Do long. Do this. Touch your nose. Do that. Stop. No, don't. She said do that. Oh, shoot. You don't think she saw me, do you? I think she saw you. Do this! Stop! 
Do that. Freeze. Nobody freeze. She said do that. Do this. Run. We've been running for hours. I can't go any longer. Come on, we have to keep going. Why? So she can torture us more? Yeah, what's the point of My this anyways? Do Mine this. too. Stop running. Did she say do this or do that? Uh, I don't know. No one heard her? Did you hear her? No. Well, what are we supposed to do? Well, I'm stopping. I'm so tired. Yeah, I am too. Would you please repeat? <laughs> she must have said do this. All the people who kept running didn't make it. You guys have to be quieter. You almost got us all killed. Us? Yes. If you weren't complaining so much, maybe everyone would have heard her and half our class would be dead. Do this. Hands on your head. Do that. Stop. Do that. Jump. Do this. Clap. Why is she talking so much? What kind of speed round is Linda, this? Linda, shh. Do you want to repeat what just happened? Do this. Close your eyes. Hey, someone just touched my... Sorry, I can't see anything. None of us can, so quit walking around and touching things. If she doesn't let us see soon, we're going to be stuck out here all night. <sighs> what was that? Did anyone else hear that? Was that a bear? Do that. Run. Nobody move. She said do that. Screw that. I'm not about to get eaten by a bear. I don't care what she says. Me neither. Do this. Open your eyes. Where's the bear? Where did it go? Do this. Go home. Hi, sweetie. How was your day? Horrible. The game made us close our eyes outside and we were almost attacked by a bear. A bear? Really? In the middle of LA? I heard it. I promise. Maybe it was one of your classmates breathing heavy. Sometimes people snore when they're awake. No, it wasn't. They heard it too. If you say so. Well, on the bright side, you graduate from the game on Friday. I know. It's the only thing keeping me going. This game sucks. Oh, honey, you're so dramatic. It's not that bad. Mom, half my classmates have died. I don't think it's the same as when you were a kid. If you say so, sweetie. Do this. Stay awake. Please, I'm so tired. Hello? Are you having a hard time staying awake too? Yeah, it's torture. I thought maybe we could talk so we stay awake. Thanks for calling. Do this. Stop. So we can sleep now? It's too late. We have to go to school. Did anyone get any sleep last night? What a stupid question, Hannah, because if they slept, they wouldn't be alive. Someone woke up on the wrong side of the bed. Do this. Touch your nose. Do this. Touch your head. Do this. Touch your mouth. Do this. Touch your ear. Do that. Touch your eye. No one did it. Guys, we're getting really good at this game. Maybe we'll make it to graduation after all. What just happened? Why did Hannah die? She moved her finger off her ear. The game hadn't told us to stop. She's gone. Do this. Stop. <sighs> Finally. How many kids do you think are left in our class? 69. Didn't we start with 420? Yeah. Two days left to this torture. Do this. Kiss. Ew. Mm. What? We have to. No, we don't. Yeah, she said do this. There. It never said kiss someone. It said kiss. Oh, uh, my bad. You really wanted to kiss me, didn't you? No, I just really wanted to live. Uh -huh. Sure. Hey, Jess. Happy graduation day. Finally. I cannot wait to be done with this game. Me too. Do this. Hold your breath. Do that. Stop. Do this. Stop. <sighs> These next hours are going to be torture, aren't they? I think torture is an understatement. I wonder what life will be like after the game. Enjoyable? I just feel bad for the underclassmen that still have to put up with this for a few more years. I heard the sophomore class is already down to 70 students. Really? Yeah, they're really bad at the game. They're dropping like flies. Do this. Spin in a circle. Do this. Faster. Do that. Stop. I'm going to puke. Keep going. You can do it. Do this. Stop. <sighs> Finally, two minutes until graduation. Guys, we've almost done it. We've almost completed the game. Do this. Play forever. Yeah, right. What the heck? What? What's going on? What the game just said? It didn't say anything. You didn't hear it? Do this. Play forever. Did you hear it that time? No. Jess, it's not talking. Three, two, one. We did it. Do this. Touch your nose. Jess, what are you doing? The game's over. I don't know. It's still giving me directions. It is? Do this. Touch your head. It's not giving us directions. What do I do? You don't have to play anymore. The rule is when you graduate, you're done with the game. I think I do. Do this. Nod your head. 
do this. Stop. So what now? You're just going to keep playing the rest of your life? I certainly couldn't. No, you're right. I shouldn't have to play anymore. Rules are rules. Do this. Touch your eye. Is it talking to you right now? Do this. Touch your eye. Don't do it. <gasps> Guys. Guys, I'm okay. I don't have to play anymore. Guys? Where am I? Welcome, Jess. You are our new leader. New leader? You now control the current players. Try it. Say do this or do that. So I just tell them to do something? Exactly. And they have to do it. Or they die. I don't know. Do it. Do this. Like and subscribe. And we... <sighs> I've never dodged that before. That was terrifying. Sweetie, I made you breakfast. Thanks. Mom, what is this? It smells rotten. Raspberry pancakes. Your favorite. I'm actually not hungry. I'll see you after school. Have a good day. What is going on today? <gasps> Billie Jean, you'll never believe it. I dodged death twice today. Wait, what? How? You're the most careful person I know. It was the weirdest thing. First, my curling iron caught on fire. Then my mom tried to feed me expired pancakes that probably had salmonella in them. I know you're freaked out, but to be honest, it's really impressive that you've made it this far without dodging death before. What's your count up to? 6,570. I dodge death once a day, but that's because I live next to an unconvicted serial killer. Your life is so strange. Look out! Sorry, I didn't see you there. I'm telling you, babe, something is up. I go 18 years without dodging death, and now I've dodged it three times in the past eight hours? So, you're having a bad day. I'm sure you'll be back in your group tomorrow. Sweetie, don't forget to take your vitamins. <laughs> Please don't be a repeat of yesterday. Is this stoplight not working? No, so just cross when no cars are coming. <laughs> Whoa, what happened to you? I got hit by a car! You what? Well, technically just a side mirror hit me, but right in my eye. That is so unlucky. Babe, this isn't a coincidence. Something's changed and I've had terrible luck all of a sudden. You know what I like about you? Is that you're not dramatic like other girls. But right now, you're being dramatic. I don't think I am. I've dodged death a lot lately. Why don't we just relax a little and go to Make Out Peak tonight? It'll be fun. I can't. I have a lot of homework. Fine. I'll see you later. Billie Jean, I have to break up with Pete. Why? You're like obsessed with him. Something in my life is giving me bad luck and I think it's him. You think it's Pete? I refused to hang out with him tonight and my dodge death count went up. That's a sign. That he was going to kill you? No, that we shouldn't be together. The universe is trying to tell me that he's not the one. Or they're trying to tell you that he wants to kill you. He's not a serial killer, Billie Jean. He's not your neighbor. <gasps> I have to find Pete. Have you seen Pete? No, sorry. You broke up with me over text? I didn't have a choice. I've been looking for you all day and I need to stop facing death. You think I'm responsible for your dodge death count being so high? No. Yes, I think it's a sign that we shouldn't be together. Well, I'll give you a sign. Please don't kill me. What? I'm not going to kill you. I was just going to give you the middle finger, but now you made it weird. Oh. Bye, Pete. How'd it go breaking up with Pete? Not well. I'm sorry. I know how much you liked him. Hopefully things can just go back to normal now and my count will stop going up. How? Literally how? Did I have like 500 heart attacks last night? Sweetie, are you okay? You don't look well. I'm not well. I went 18 years without dodging death once and in the last two days, I've dodged it hundreds of times. Something is very wrong in my life and I've misread all of the signs. How about you stay home from school today? I think you need the rest. Thanks, Mom. My count didn't go up when I decided to stay home from school. That means school's safe. Mom, I changed my mind. I actually am going to go to school today. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh my gosh. 
If it wasn't Pete who was bad for me, it's my mom. Billie Jean, can I please come live with you? You can, but sometimes I think you forget that my neighbor's a serial killer. Well, so is my mom. Wait, what? Not really, but I do think she might be trying to kill me. First Pete, now your mom? No, turns out it wasn't Pete. I misread the signs. So what are you gonna do? Pete, I am so sorry. I realized it wasn't you after all. Do you want to get back together? Sorry, Jess, but I'm already dating Becky. We broke up yesterday. I know, so I really think it's time you move on. It's been like 14 hours. Jess, I'm so sorry, but my mom said no to you living with us. It's okay. Thanks for trying. Guess it's time to go confront my mom. Be safe. Oh, good. You're home. I made you some dinner. Is it poisoned? Poisoned? Every time I'm in this house, my dodge death count triples. I don't think that's a coincidence. Sweetie, I do not know what is going on with you today, but I can guarantee I'm not trying to hurt you. I don't believe a word you say. I'm gonna go live with Grandma. At the nursing home? Yes. <gasps> I knew it! Hi, Grandma. Sweetheart, what are you doing here? I'm just trying to hide away from death. Well, you didn't come to the right place. Marjorie died today. Psst, Barb, should I cut her head off? Grandma, what's in your hand? A voodoo doll of the nurse here. My roomie Barb made it. We hate that nurse, so we've been doing all sorts of things to it. Barb accidentally cut its eye open, so we had to repair that, but I stuck a needle through its heart at least 500 times. That's horrible. Oh, don't worry, sweetie. Nothing's even happened to Nurse Jackie. In fact, she's happier than ever, unfortunately. Grandma, this isn't a voodoo doll of Nurse Jackie. This is a voodoo doll of me. Don't be ridiculous. That looks nothing like you. Barb, do you think that looks like her? No. See, it's Nurse Jackie. I'm keeping this. You want to give Nurse Jackie a good beating too? That's my granddaughter. <laughs> You're back? How was staying with Grandma? Eye opening. Grandma had this. A voodoo doll of you? She thought it looked like Nurse Jackie, who apparently she hates. Your grandma is blinder than a bat. Sweetie, I'm so sorry that happened to you. I'm just glad it's in my hands now. Time for you to go where no one will find you. Lucy, come on, we're gonna be late. Hang on, Mom, I see something. <laughs> Aw, we're gonna be best friends. Sweetie, don't forget the lipstick. Today is so important. As soon as you get your mark, you must change it to red. No one can know or pray. You can't mess this up. I won't. You can count on me. I know. It's just our family has been disguised as hunters for... For 3,000 years. You've mentioned it. It's the best survival tool. Have a good day. I will. Are you excited or what? I'm stressed. Why? Just because there's a chance that we wouldn't get the same thing and then we couldn't be friends anymore. Your whole family is hunters, right? Yeah. Same. There's no way we won't be able to be friends. You're right. Now get excited. All right, class, you will be getting your selection in one minute. For prey, please leave the school grounds immediately. Hunters, you stay at this school. School ground killings are prohibited. Cover your faces. Get ready for your marks. Hunter? I guess I don't have to change my mark. You're a hunter. Yeah, thank God. I wouldn't want to disappoint my family. I know. Could you imagine? Hey, where are you going? It's my time to hunt. Already? I'm skipping class to go hunting with my family. It's going to be epic. What happens if you don't hunt when you're supposed to? Bad things. The longer you wait to hunt, the less control you have. You could accidentally kill another hunter. Did your parents mention that? Yeah. Oh, good. How'd it go? Oh, good. You changed your mark. Yeah, um, about that. Did somebody see you change it? No, no one saw me change it. Oh, thank goodness. We but, are so proud of you, Jess. This will be our first official dinner as prey. I have to tell her I'm a hunter for real. Time to hunt? Hey, are you still hunting? Yeah, why? It's my time. Can I come meet you? Yeah, sure. Meet us at the park. Jess, you made it. But why didn't your family want to take you on your first hunt? Why didn't your parents take you hunting? Oh, because they're actually out of town. Oh, really? Yeah, on a hunting trip in Alaska, so they'll be gone for a few more days. Oh, well, I'm so glad you could come with us. Me too. Do you have eyes on the target? Yes, sir. The guy on the right? <laughs> That's a hunter. So it's really good you have a bad aim. Sorry. Watch where you're shooting. 
The guy on the left? <laughs> That's Prey. Good shot. <laughs> that was so much fun. Slow down, new hunter. You don't want to overkill. But maybe you can come with us next time. I'd love that. Jess, wait. Yeah? My dad said you did great, but I know your parents aren't on vacation. I saw your mom at the store earlier. Is everything okay? Yeah, we just got into a little fight. It's no big deal. But thanks for not telling anyone. Yeah, of course. I'm here if you need anything, okay? Jess, where have you been? Sorry, I was out with some friends. You missed our first prey dinner as a family. I didn't think it was that big of a deal. That big of a deal? You left without even telling us. We made your favorite dinner. I'm sorry. Okay, well, go ahead and wash off your red mark. We want to see your blue. I can't wash it off. What do you mean? I am a hunter. No, this can't be possible. That's why I skipped dinner. I was out hunting. Jerry, get in here. This is horrible. Horrible? This is what you guys have spent your whole lives pretending to be. We should be celebrating. We're finally hunters. We don't really want to be hunters. We just pretend. They're killers. They're horrible people. If you really feel that strongly about them, why pretend to be them? For our own safety. You can't hunt hunters. It's the best protection method. I thought you understood that. I want you out. Really? Get out of my house. If you throw me out, people are going to ask questions. She's right, Maria. We can't just throw her out. It'll blow our cover. She could hurt us. Marjorie, hey. Hey, Jess. It's time to hunt again. Did you want to come? That would be great. I'll be right back. Just wait here. Hey, Mr. and Mrs. Kaylee. Did you want to come hunting with us? No, thanks, Marjorie. Maybe next time. That's weird. I've never seen your parents hunt before. It's almost like they're, they're really busy. They're prey. Jess, could I come in? Marjorie, you can't just barge in like that. Stop. You guys are prey, aren't you? Jess, what did you do? Nothing. That would explain why you guys never hunt. <sighs> Jess, are you okay? What's wrong? No. I need to hunt. I need to hunt. Okay, Jess, just calm down. Sweetie. What are you doing? Put it down. No, 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 no. What did you do? You're okay. Look at me. Marjorie, come on. Marjorie? You killed her. But she protected us. Get rid of the body. Jess, come with me. I didn't mean to hurt anyone. I couldn't control myself. It's okay, sweetie. You did the right thing protecting us. It was an accident. We're going to fix this. Would you like to change your mark? Mom! I can choose to be a prey. I don't have to be a hunter anymore. What? It's letting me switch. No! You have selected switch mark. Just change it back. I don't know how. Well, you have to try. I'm sorry I don't under. I'm sorry. I'm sore. I, I, I. Access granted. You are now able to choose three people you'd like to protect. Jess, you did it. You can still protect us even when you become prey. Good job, sweetheart. Make your selections now. I choose mom. Did you say Tom? No, mom. You said mom, right? Yes. Thank God. My mistake, save God. No. I'm not sure I understand. Mom. Protecting mom. Dad is now protected. Please make your final selection. Go ahead, sweetie. Protect yourself. I choose. Why would you choose Marjorie? She died. If there's a chance to bring her back, I had to try. Sweetie, she's not coming back. And now you're not protected. I'll be okay. Thank you for your selections. Your mark will change now. Jess? It worked. What happened? I don't remember anything. What's important is that you're here now. Wait, you're Mark. You're Prey? Yeah. Don't worry. I won't tell anyone. But I need your help with something. Happy five days of deadly curses. No, I don't want to play this here. You don't have a choice. Tap the button to unfold your fate. Please, don't make me do this. Oh, I see. You think you're special and deserve to be the only human exempt from the game. Yes! Yes, I really do! Too bad, you little lunatic. Tap that button. Can't sneeze? What's the matter? Cat got your tongue. 
Most people love this one. I have allergies and it's the middle of spring. Well then, you're going to die. Enjoy your last day. Jess, are you okay? No, my deadly curse, it's bad. What is it? I can't sneeze. Jess, that's one of the good ones. At least you can still breathe. I have allergies, Billie Jean. I know, just don't go outside. What did you get? I got can't sing, so if I went and I will always, that would be really <gasps> bad. Jess, stop stressing. This is only the first day and we have an entire week to get through. Plus, you survived last year's, you're going to survive this year's. Tell that to Billie Jean, who just died. Plus, you know I barely survived the games last year, when I got couldn't pee. But you did. Uh, uh, no. <gasps> Thank you, you saved me. Okay class, today we're going to be learning about smell. For this experiment, you'll be sniffing your partner's fingers, then documenting what you think it smells like. I can't do that today, Mrs. Stevens. If I sneeze, I die. If I gave every student an exemption during the Deadly Games week, we would never get anything done. But- Do your best, Jessica. <sighs> oh, that smells bad. Did you just sniff my finger? I swear that's what she said to do. After we dip it in the essential oils, you weirdo. Oh, my bad. Lavender, definitely. Yeah, definitely. <sighs> no, don't. <laughs> Did you just kiss me? Jonathan, did you just kiss me? Yeah. Why? You were about to sneeze, and you can't sneeze when you're kissing. You saved my life. It's no biggie. Later. Hey! Well, why don't you just stay close, just in case it happens again? Day one is complete. Hopefully today's deadly curse is way better than yesterday's. Tap the button to unfold your fate. Can't bleed? Okay, so no bloody noses or hangnails, and definitely no Mother Nature. Hey! Blake, watch where you're throwing that thing. Sorry, grumpy pants. I can't bleed today and you almost smacked me right in the face. Wish I would have. Why do you get all the easy ones? Nothing feels easy when you have CBL. CBL? Chronic bad luck. Oh, Jess, will you help me pass out the papers? Sure, Miss Nelson. Here you go. Thank you. And one for you. Thanks. What? What's wrong? Paper cut. Are you okay? Is it bleeding? I think I'm okay. It didn't break the skin. Oh, thank goodness. You need to be more careful. Jonathan, were you worried about me? I'm worried about everyone. I hate the deadly games. Day three of the deadly curses. I can do this. Keep telling yourself that, but you barely survived yesterday. Thanks, sis, for reminding me. Tap the button to unfold your fate. I can't blink? Marjorie? What's wrong? My sister didn't make it. She got can't think. That's physically impossible. I am so sorry. Thanks. What's with the glasses? I got can't blink and this is helping my eyes not dry out. See? Ah! <gasps> Marjorie? She must have got can't scream. My eyes are really starting to burn. You know you can just keep your eyes closed. I can? Yeah. I got that curse last year. You just can't open them again until the next day. I wouldn't be able to find my way home. Well, if you want to do it, I could take you to your house. Just let me know. Jonathan, that would be really helpful. Guys, I can't sneeze and I'm about to. Here. <coughs> Jonathan. Jonathan, what the heck? What? Do you kiss every girl who can't sneeze? If they're about to die, yeah. <gasps> You're such a jerk. Ugh. <sighs> Two more days. Tap the button to unfold your fate. Can't lie? This might not be too bad. Good morning, sweetie. How are the games going? Horrible. There's nothing worse than the deadly game week. I know, but you're doing so good. And when you're 26, you won't have to play anymore. That's still eight more years. Hey, Jess. Jonathan. Today's not a great day to talk. Why? What's your deadly curse? I can't lie. Really? Good. Then you can tell me if you like me. Uh, uh, well, I like a lot of things like ice cream and pink and Taylor Swift and you. And me? And you and Taylor Swift and pink <laughs> and... Okay, I'll see you around, Jess. What? You're not even going to tell me if you like me back? Ugh, men! <gasps> Emma, are you okay? Yeah, it's just I got... I you got, got what? 
I got I can't cry. And let's stop. <laughs> this week cannot end soon enough. The final day of Deadly Curse Week, and then I won't have to worry about it until next year. Tap the button to unfold your fate. Please don't be pee. Please don't be pee. Hmm? Hmm? Mm. Jess, what did you get today? Mm hmm? Hmm, hmm, hmm. You can't speak? Mm hmm? Lucky, I can't move my head. I might mm. not even be wearing pants right now. I can't mm -hmm. check. <gasps> Boo! <laughs> Got ya. You did what with your grandma? And your grandpa? I cannot speak and I just screamed. Does that count? Not sure, but that definitely did.